The Vampiric Tyrant by Satanic Warmaster. The song is in standard tuning and it starts like this. <laughs> So I'm tremolo picking the A string and the D string. So the first part of the riff, I'm going to play an open A and 7 of the D, 9 of the D, 14, 15, 14. So. Then I'm going to play 7 of the A and 10 of the D, 9 of the D and keep this on the 7 of the A. Then we're going to play a power chord on the 3rd fret of the A. And whilst I'm playing that power chord, I'm going to put this down on the 4th fret of the G string. So we've got that B note. And I'm going to play that. Play that B. You can use the open B. So again. the opening riff. Then we have So I'm trembling picking again on the A and the D and it's playing an open A power chord, third fret power chord on the A, open again and then up to the 5th fret, so. Over the top of that riff we have this. So, on the D string, fret 7, 9 of the G, 7 of the G, 9 of the G, 10 of the D, 9 of the G, seven, uh, 9 of the D, and then 9 of the G again. So that's 7, 9, 7, 9, 10, 9, 9, 9. Play that three times. Then we got seven of the G, ten of the B, eight of the B, ten of the B, ten of the G, ten of the B, nine of the G, and then ten of the B. So again, that's 7, 10, 8, 10, 10, 10, 9, 10. back into the opening riff. Then we're back into this riff. section as well. Then we have this riff. So 
So again on the tremolo picking on the A and the D string. So open A and 10 of the D. Open and 9. Open and 10. Open and 9. Then I'm going to play a power chord on fret 7 of the A string. Power chord on fret 8 of the A string. Then I'm going to bring the little finger up to 12 on the D. So that's 12 and then off. So together. Repeat the first part. Repeat this power chord on fret 7 and then down to fret 3 and this is all on the A. So slowly. Then I've got this riff. So this time I'm playing on the D and the G. So I'm playing open D, 7 of the G, 10 of the G, 9 of the G, 5 to 7 on the G. Okay, again that's 7, 10, 9, 5, 7. But the D is played open throughout that. Then I've got 8 of the D and 7 of the G. Then I'm going to move my first finger to this 8th fret and the fleshy part of my finger here is going to mute that G string. Okay, so if I'm not playing the G string with one of my other fingers then it's going to ring out and you're not going to hear it because it's just muted. So we've got... Then I've got first finger on 8 of the D, little finger on 12 of the G, 10 of the G, 9 of the G. So slowly. So you'll notice that I keep on, I'm still tremolo picking those two notes. But the G will only ring out when I hit it, okay? So again, that's the D and the G on 12, 10, 9, then 10 of the D, 9 of the G, then again I move my first finger to the 10 of the D, little finger up to 14 of the G, and then 12, so... this riff. Which is what we played a minute ago. So that's open A and 10 9 10 9 on the D. Seventh fret power chord on the A. Eighth fret power chord on the A. Little finger up to 12 of the D and then off then open A 10 9 10 9 on the D power chord on 7 of the A and then down to 3 of the A then finally we're back into this riff And then we just finish on a D power chord on the 5th fret of the A string. 
make sure you subscribe for more black metal.